Dear one, you recently called upon us to help you understand forgiveness. I know you have a few people in your life whom you believe you would benefit greatly to forgive. And I know you have been trying. But what I'm about to say to you may surprise or even shock you. Truth is, what you have set out to do is an impossible task. Books have been written on the subject telling you how forgiving and letting go can heal your wounds, how it benefits your physical health and releases negativity. And it is true, but it is only part of it. What you have been told to go for cannot be accomplished through action. In other words, you cannot forgive in that forgiveness does not come as a result of a deliberate effort. There is no action that you can offer that will bring forgiveness. Forgiveness is a state. State of non-resistance. State of being in the flow. When you are in that state, forgiveness comes as a side effect. Naturally and with no effort. If you remember the story of Jesus of Nazareth, you may recall everyone admiring his ability to forgive. Yet I tell you this, he never forgave anyone. I repeat, Jesus never forgave anyone. He simply never had to. At the level of vibration where he predominantly dwelled, non-forgiving was not an option. It was simply not possible. So, dear one, it would be my advice to you to not worry much about trying to forgive, for the very act of trying runs counter to the essence of forgiveness. Be easy on yourself. Look for things and activities that bring you joy and seek people who resonate with you and leave everyone else be any way they want to be. It was never your role to make them happy. Neither was theirs to bring happiness to you. There is no need to wait for apology. When you begin to spend more and more time in the vibration of trust and non-resistance, you will one day discover that feelings of resentment, jealousy, anger, unworthiness, rejection, betrayal, and abandonment that you may have been carrying with you for a very long time are gone and have been replaced with a warm feeling that you call compassion and love. Now go and live your life in the very best way you know how. And if it doesn't seem to work out today, it will tomorrow. That's my angelic promise to you. You are loved beyond limits and beyond comprehension. So be blessed. And always remember, we are only one prayer away.